Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Tonight I'll be doing a review on the Oral-B Vitality Toothbrush. I've had it for about a week now, but I said I wanted to do a review with you guys prior to using it. Here it is. Now keep in mind, I am super old school, so I've been using the basic toothbrush, um, just, you know, one off the rack, nothing fancy. But one of my homegirls, she told me years ago, like before I became a mom, she was like, once you go electric, you won't go back. So people say that about so many things, you know? And so I never quite wanted to just leap into it because I was like, okay, well, if I really enjoy it, then that means I'll have to keep it up. And, you know, we all, when we think about doing things, we think about the, well, not all of us, but a lot of us think about the maintenance process. Side note. My lips have been done since like four o'clock today and it's after nine. So yay for this lipstick. I think it's like a beauty supply brand. So I am going in and just opening the box here at the bottom. Jumping right into the video, the nitty gritty of this. This was purchased at Walmart and I purchased it with my own money. I didn't have anyone sponsor this video or anything like that. So these will be all truths. So here we go. Here it is, straight out the box. Now, as far as the toothbrush, it tells your basic facts that we that all toothbrushes do. They remove more plaque than your normal manual toothbrush. Of course, they're gonna say that because it's electric. Uh, it only has one mode and it provides a daily clean. These are also things that your standard toothbrush do, do. It comes with a charging base and then the toothbrush, no additional heads, no floss flossers or anything like that. And here tells you exactly what's in the box. The handle, charger, brush head, that's it. So, here we go. Oops, Chloe, can you grab that for me? Sure, hi. Mm -hmm. Okay, so out of the box, you are going to see the charging port or base. And it's just in a standard cardboard box that is taped closed to keep the contents inside. And then the base has a long charger, which will work out very well for me because my electric socket is kind of far from where I keep my toothbrush. So here you go, maybe about three feet of cord. And then, this just held it in place. You have an oil, oil B, I can't talk tonight for some reason. You have an oil B brush head. And it also has a little ring inside. I'm assuming that ring will, look at my nails because I brought my plants in before starting this video but yes I'm assuming that goes around but I'm not gonna put it on before reading directions because I definitely didn't read them before opening it here's the toothbrush I do like the weight to it it's like a little weapon but there's the actual toothbrush and we're gonna see if it came with a little bit of charge or none at all. So, also inside, they gave me a little coupon booklet. So you can save up to $10. I thought they were gonna Send me $10 for what I already purchased. 
but it's just replacement heads. $3 off coupon. And it's telling you that you can get up to $10 off when you register at Oralbee.com. I'll check it out and see what's going on with that. All right, so here we go. The instruction pamphlet. Because none of us read the instructions. So it gives you pictures, which I notice a lot of things that you buy these days, they just give you pictures. I mean, I, I understand a lot of people are illiterate, so I guess that works. But some of us do like to read a little too, but it's giving you pictures of how to use it. And then it has important safeguards, danger, and warning signs. It's also telling you about other important things such as periodically checking the product for cord damage. So that lets us know that someone has been electrocuted because they had cord damage. It tells you not to touch the power plug with wet hands. Once again, someone has been electrocuted. And when unplugging, always hold the power cord instead of the plug instead of the cord, okay? So, it's telling you not to modify or repair this item and don't give it to kids under three. Now that, I have a five-year-old and she's not getting a $30 toothbrush. And if the head breaks on it, don't use it, okay? So, replace it every three months. That's what we want to hear. Replace it every three months to make sure that it's still intact to use. Now, they do have information about the timer, charging and operating. So, you're going to charge it 16 hours to get a full charge. But it enables you to use it eight days. Okay, okay. And overcharging is impossible. So if you leave it charged, you don't have any issues with that, okay? You can uh, wet the brush head, apply any kind of toothbrush, any kind of toothpaste you want, and use it just like a standard toothbrush. Now, this one comes with a... I want to say it's a sensitive brush head, but that's just me saying that because that's what people are supposed to have, but it doesn't actually say. It just says brush head. So you actually have to look at this and see what type you have, okay? Gives you four options and it looks like we have the Orby 3D white brush head. So 3D white, okay? And this is for occasional or everyday polishing. Why would they give that to you if you can't use it daily? But it does say occasional or everyday polishing. And of course, it's dentist expired. So let's jump right in and see how to assemble this bad boy. So we have the base. I'm opening the brush head. If I wasn't on camera, I would just jam it on, but let's see. I was right. You do put the little blue ring on the base of the head. So 
So pop that bad boy on. As Chloe would say, pop that baby on. And then I'm gonna look at the front of it. Easy peasy. So first thoughts, 30 bucks. Mm, no, but I'm gonna give it a try. I'll roll it around and let you guys know how it feels. And if it feels any different from my standard brush, I used my standard brush earlier today. And when I get all this off, I'll use this to let you know. And I'll be using it with the Crest 3D right white. Oh my gosh, I'm so tongue to tongue tied tonight. So it's even telling you how to brush your teeth. So in case you've forgotten or you don't do it the right way, hey, all the instructions are here. So in the next clip, you'll see what I think as far as is it worth $30? And this is the Oral B Vitality, and it has a 3D white brush head with it. Now, I am gonna turn it on just to see. Yes, so it does come with some charge. And baby, this thing feels like a massager. It does, so. With that being said, hmm. curious to see how it's gonna feel in there. All right, so I'm not gonna put it on the charger. I'm gonna get all this gunk off, take me a shower, brush my teeth, and I'll report back and let you guys know what I think about it. Is it worth it or is it not? Okay, stay tuned, bye-bye. All right, as promised, I'm looking all, you know, basic <laughs> and i wanted to show you guys with the toothbrush one thing i wanted to say is that this toothbrush base once you put the toothbrush on it it doesn't power on i thought that was kind of cool and also it doesn't have any of those little notches that you normally see when it's you know something that needs to be charged so i'm gonna go in with my Crest 3D White, nothing fancy, and brush these teeth. All right, so the toothpaste is on, it's wet, all that, so here we go. Okay, so I did not show you guys, you know, cleaning the tongue and getting in nitty gritty, but holy moly, this thing is awesome. Like, I don't think I've ever felt my mouth like this before. I brush my teeth like two, three times a day. Whoa. So, 
I'm going to definitely give this two first a 10 out of 10 just because I have not used an, you know, $100 toothbrush. But this thing right here is awesome. And I noticed, like, I want to say maybe when you're at, you might be at the two minute mark and it starts like a little extra shaking move um and it like revs up but once you, and i just really let it do its own thing oh my god so when i went off camera i went to you know doing my tongue and like really man whoa I think I'm in love. And this is exactly why. Because now, see, I told you guys, beforehand, I would have had to maintain a habit. Well, here we go. Maintaining a habit because I'm sold. 10 out of 10 for me. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe. Comment below. Let me know what you think. Um, no, I'm not going to have my mouth wide open, scrubbing my tongue for you guys. But yes. Definitely 10 out of 10. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.